When it comes to films, we of course know that box office is a huge key to success. Some will say it's the only key, even though there's films out there that are clearly made not for the box office, but for the Oscars. Star Wars lands on that box office hype. So let's talk about the opening weekend anticipation. So we've seen an interesting pattern when it comes to Star Wars. With the original trilogy, with the prequels, and now we might be seeing it with this one. The first film does pretty damn good. Force Awakens and The Phantom Menace. The second film does in the middle, Attack of the Clones and The Last Jedi. And the third film looks to go past all of them with Sith and Rise of Skywalker. And that's what it's looking like it might happen in the long forecast. But for right now, we're gonna talk about the opening box office, which of course is going to account for the first weekend in the United States. That's the big numbers we're talking about right now. And right now, most analysts and all the big websites are putting out their articles talking about it. If you guys just Google search box office predictions for the weekend, you'll be able to find all of them so I don't have to link them all down below or put them all up on the screen. The general consensus, if you combine about six different outlets, is somewhere between 180 and $200 million on the high end. So if you're following the box office, this is a little bit lower than some of the other ones. But then again, they're saying that they don't know. You know, some people are considering the backlash to The Last Jedi and are saying this might factor into it. Others are saying no. There's a few out there that are saying 225 might be the limit, you know, and that's like kind of the top of it. We don't know till it happens. But I think the indicator here is it will do great. You know, it's Star Wars. It's gonna make back its budget by the time it's done the first weekend in the entire world. So that's a big one. It's guaranteed to go past a billion. I think everybody knows that, but it's how far will it go past that? And the opening weekend really will set that tone. If it comes down and does like 225, it's blown way past expectations. All the naysayers will, you know, have to kind of face it that the franchise isn't dead because of Solo or The Last Jedi, you know, it didn't do it. If it opens up at 200, still, that's the high end estimate. So we're going to be looking at 100 the following weekend and maybe 60 to 70 so it's gonna have legs that much is clear and um i think just going into this thursday you know on friday and saturday and looking at each individual day what people are really going to want to do is just kind of look at it and then look at your theater and get the reflection and the consensus of the people that are there and then look online and see what people there are saying because i know sometimes the two don't add up like for example with the last jedi right people were saying that nobody's going to see the movie but i remember seeing it a couple times after the first week and it was still Still packed. So there's a difference there from what they say online to what's being presented to what's actually happening in real life and depend on where you live. But overall, 200 million for this opening weekend is still rather impressive. I mean, is somebody gonna really tell you being like, yeah, this movie failed and only made 200 million dollars on its opening weekend in the US. And then they'll be like, yeah, this movie made 40. Rest in peace, Marvel. You know who you are.